Hey guys, what's going on? Let me tell you what's going on. I'm catching up on a video that I should have did a while back. Pulled pork breakfast hash. Super simple recipe. Cooked a pork butt yesterday. Pulled it last night. Made some sandwiches. We had leftovers. Going in the skillet. Some bell pepper, some onions, some potato. You'll see. It's going to be fun. It's going to be money. It's going to be easy. Good little breakfast, all right? Like I always say, stick around. Right, first thing we're going to do is we're going to get a little olive oil in the pan, just a little bit. Let that warm up for a few minutes, and then we're going to put some taters in there, all right? Hang tight. We're also going to spray those taters with some duck fat. It's good stuff on taters. Trust me. Trust me, trust me. All right, our pan is hot. Our oil is hot. We're going to go and drop some taters in here. Want to brown these up a little bit. Another routine. We've all done taters, right? It's not that complicated. Right, this potato has been going for a little bit. Flip them around a little more. Keep them going. Now, to help soften these up, I want to get a good little color on them, but to help soften them up, it's going to put a little bit of water in here, okay? Be careful. All right. So at this time, since we got a little color, I'm going to be elevated even more. Try to say with some uh, again, so I dump that. So we just kind of do that. And while we're doing that, we're going to add our veggies in here that I cut up earlier. Let's get them going. Saute those a little bit. Go ahead and add a little bit of oil on there too. Just a little. There you go. Also gonna add a little of that Texas Trinity. Throw that in there on the veggies, taters. That's it. We've been going for a little bit, just a few minutes. We're going to mix them up. I am going to add a little something to it. By the way, I didn't say we were started to cook at a, on the electric stove at about number seven. This is medium high. I've lowered it to medium. Now we're going to add a little pickled jalapenos in here just for a little heat, a little flavor. Get those in just a couple, just a few here and there. Get to that surprise bite when you want it. You know, I don't really want to cook them too much. I'm just going to grill them a little bit. You need to also check the taters. We do want them to get till pork tender. So you just want to, and there you go. About right. All right, so get that going. Now we'll add in our pulled pork we made yesterday. It's been in the refrigerator sitting it is cold but we're just going to go ahead and add a little in here just warm it up whatever we're not going to do the whole thing i am still saving this for some sandwiches some sammies. Put that in there. Get those done. And warm up in no time. All right, bring it back in a bit. I can see our pork is warming up. Again, we, it's, it's cooked. It's pulled pork. It's been on the smoker cabinet smoker for a while. That's smoking text. 
we're just warming it up, mixing with the veggies, constantly stirring it around. About that point now, we're going to add our eggs. Again, this is a breakfast hash with full pork. All right, we're going to go with four medium eggs. Quick. You can do four, you can do six, you can do as many as you want. I want to get that pork with a little bit of that egg in there. I'm just going to go ahead and do four. Actually, you know what? Let's do five. Just because I said so. That one actually had a dent on it already. Five. Go ahead and get these eggs in. Yeah, I'm not mixing. I'm going to stir them in here. So they're going to go just like that. All right now, I'm going to go ahead and sprinkle a little of this hardcore carnivore jalapeno on it. Just for a little more kick. Get that egg stirred around. Broke up. Again, not a lot of egg, but that's the way I like it. Add as many or as little as you like. Again, it's on a medium low heat. Just want to get this mixed up and get those eggs cooked. All right. All right, let's come back and get these finished up. As you can see, that is our pulled pork breakfast hash. Potatoes, bell peppers, onion, a little bit of grilled jalapeno in there and about five eggs this is going to go on some tacos you could plate it up just on its own but let's go ahead and get that done and just show that off real quick and give it a taste looks killer though that's the way i like it super simple pulled pork hash recap what we did today all right pulled pork breakfast hash got a yellow bell pepper got a orange bell pepper, dice those up, got an onion, dice that up, about half an onion. Potatoes, breakfast hash is not hash without potatoes. Got the taters diced up, got them in a skillet with a little olive oil. Got the olive oil cooked up, it was about a medium heat. Got the olive oil hot, got the taters in. Sauteed them for a little bit to that oil burned off, add a little bit of water just to get the potatoes a little more tender. I then lowered the heat to medium. I put my onions, I put my bell peppers in there, got that sauteed for a little bit, added some pickled jalapenos. You can add fresh if you'd like. Let that saute for a few minutes, turn the heat down just a little bit. I took the pulled pork out of the fridge, got that in that skillet. It, pulled pork was cold, obviously, but we warmed it up slowly, brought it up to temperature, let that cook good, mix the flavors up in there. Add a little uh, Texas Trinity to it all. Added some hardcore carnivore jalapeno salt to that. Got it all mixed up. Warmed up some tortillas. Put it on a plate. Served it like that. You could make tacos if you'd like. You can make burritos, whatever you want to call them. Uh, either way, it's an excellent, easy dish for leftovers on your pulled pork. Also, it's great for brisket, right? Works real good on brisket, too. But pulled pork hash breakfast, that's what we had today. I was going to make tacos, but I decided to go ahead and just put them on the plate. I think got my flour tortillas. That's there just for thumbnail, right? Got my cup of coffee sitting here. But let's go ahead and take a little taste. Go ahead and get a little piece of this tortilla here. Or tortilla. Mexican, but it's going to get mad at me. Call me wrong. Take a little tear. Grab a little bit of that hash on here. It's still a little hot, as you can see. There. Mm hmm Smoky. Got that Texas Trinity. Put a little Cholula on here. I didn't have any hot sauce. That's good. Good flavor. Good point. Only thing that really would have made it better is a side of uh, maybe some refried beans. Maybe a little cheese on top. Do it your way. Let me know how you do yours. Put it in the description below or in comments below. And we'll go from there. But breakfast time. Let me finish this up. Mm -hmm. A little coffee.
Mm-hmm. Oh, yeah. Guys, this video was due. I should have put it out a few weeks back. Long story, but here it is. Appreciate you watching. I always say thanks. Be safe. God bless. Catch you on the next one.